Dredging, what is dredging? Practically, you are dropping a fly at the bottom of the ocean and you're hoping for something large to, to take your fly. And uh, it's deep and dirty. It's not necessarily uh, considered traditional fly fishing, but you know, when in Rome, you travel half the world to uh, restrict yourself. So yeah, dredging. You never know what you're gonna get. Uh, it's usually very colorful, or angry or both. This one was uh, just colorful. <laughs> So, basic outfit for the dredging here. We're trying to uh, kill some time uh, during the neap tides here. So a pretty big fly, something that's uh, shiny and gives us a bit of a profile because we're fishing blue water, we're fishing the edge of a reef. We have a 500 to 750 grain sinking line. In this particular case, that's the Aflo Big Game uh, because it's a little bit longer. We've opted for a 12, foot, uh, 12 weight, 8.6 foot glass rod, um, not the most common fly rod you'll see out there, but um, you will see during the video why we have a glass rod. Um, it has a particular advantage of a carbon fiber rods doing this kind of fishing. Um, and yeah, um, as you can see here, or you may not see it, it's like a lot of features beneath us. There's an awful lot of bait fish. During a neap tide, the uh, high tides are lower and the low tides are higher and the amplitude between the tides is generally not as um, hard. So what we find out here, a lot of the apex predator will be outside in the reef. That's what we're trying to catch. So we drop this thing down vertically, or if you want to kit yourself, you might as well do a bit of a fly cast here. And you run the line all the way down to your desired depth. There's already a fish looking at it, funnily, on the drop. You can see it. Let's see if he gets it. It's coming, it's coming. You see it? It's a G. Stop it, stop it. He was on it. Do you see him circling it? Yeah. He was so keen. So uh, what, I was, what I was about to say is like you want to have full control of your sinking process because you never know when it's going to take. So I'm running the line through my fingers here and through Paolo's toes. Then you strip it up as fast as you can. As soon as you get a bite because sometimes you get a knock, you drop it back down just to see. You're like you guys back home, you're like, oh, I could do this all day. No, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> you can't, because it's work. Fucking has it. Me big time. <laughs> it's not big. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, we're right on the edge here. I'm gonna drop it off the edge again. Wow. Good cast. Something's gonna happen here now because that's that's the money. Looked like a jeet, huh? Good drift here, I like that. Before we were moving much slower, now we're actually covering some water here. Just 
right over the edge. Um, one of the many colorful fish that you find here on the reef. We're gonna put this one back. You never know, you never know, but we're still looking for a screamer. <laughs> <laughs> 